Hey y'all, it's Courtney, and I am back with just a really quick video. Um, I was not planning on making a video today, that's why I've got this thrown up, thrown together makeup look going on. Um, I mean, I guess it doesn't look too bad for like a 10 minute look. Um, but anyways, uh, I just wanted to get on here in support of a good friend of mine, uh, Kelly Huff. Um, she's been going through a rough time. Um, and if you guys can, go to her channel and watch her video, the video that her husband uploaded. So fucking sweet. I almost cried. Like, what a good man. What a wonderful man you have. Um, it was, that was the sweetest video ever. And, Kelly is a good person. A very good person. And just because everybody in the community doesn't, you know, have to get along or doesn't have to like each other, doesn't make her a bad person. Um, so, whether you guys have fought in the past or you get along or whatever, if you guys can just go leave a, a, even a comment for Kelly or a DM on Twitter or a text or a um, tweet on Twitter or, you know, or do like this and make a video. Um... She's been really depressed lately. Um, they've been going through a lot of family issues, a lot of death going on right now. And um, I think everybody can understand that right now. That I think everybody's going through a rough time right now. But when you get down in a deep depression like that, it is so hard to get back up. Um, my God, I know that. I, I know it. Um, it's so... It, Bridget, Boston, you know, Boston girl Bridget said perfectly. Um, it's so easy to fall into and so hard to get back out. It, it, it's, it's like a hole. You trip and you fall in and it's so easy to fall down in a hole, but it's hell climbing back out. And it really is. And I know that people sometimes when they get in a depression like this, they feel like they don't want to burden anybody with their issues or that, you know, everybody else has got enough going on. I, they, I you know, I don't want to burden them with my problems on top of everything else. And so many people suffer in silence. And that's, for a lot of people, that's. One of their biggest mis mistakes that they never told anybody how they were feeling. And they never told anybody that they just needed some help or somebody to talk to or somebody to listen. Um, so please, if you're feeling that way, let somebody know. Talk to somebody. I can guarantee you, I don't care who you are. There's somebody that will listen if you, if you are depressed, just having a bad day, anything. There's somebody that's more than happy to listen to you, I promise. I don't care if you're a shit person. Somebody loves you enough that they want to listen to your problems. Um, so Kelly, um, there are so many people in this community that love and adore you and know how good of a person you are. And, um, we're here for you. We, I'm sure we've all, you know, been in a tough time too. And, um, it's okay not to be okay. It's okay to be going through a rough time. And it's okay to tell people and ask for help and um, don't feel guilty or don't feel like a burden or don't feel any kind of bad way about just needing a little pick-me-up or needing a little um, positivity or needing um, just somebody to listen. There's nothing wrong with that. So if you need anything from any of us, I know myself personally, and I'm sure I speak for lots of other people whenever I say, we are all here for you. Anything that you need, we're all here. We all love you dearly, and um, we hope that you can snap out of this. Um, I know that's a lot easier said than done, and you can't just snap out of it when you get in a depression. I understand that. I, I get it. But... Maybe, you know, get out and take a hike with that lovely husband of yours. Um, well, you can't go to the movies. See, that's the bad thing right now is you can't really do a whole lot to, you know, get yourself out of a funk. So, it's rough. But anything that you think will help, do it. And don't forget to self-care. That is one of the biggest things that you can do for yourself is to treat yourself. And I know that that's hard right now, too, because 
there's not a lot you can do, but we can figure something out. Um, I know you're strong, and I know you'll make it out of this, um, but for now, don't feel bad about not being okay. Love you so much.